Hi everybody, I'm about to do a general reading for everyone for July 22nd to July 28th. It's a little too hard to do cafecito con taro. So we'll film it tonight. Let's see what we got for everybody for the week. Okay, so let's see. first card we get is the Page of Pentacles, followed by the Seven of Cups in reverse, the Ace of Cups upright, and the Four of Pentacles. So right here, what is basically telling me is that you're gonna have a brand new opportunity this week. Um, actually, it's something that you've already been thinking about. Um, it could be with something that you're starting to work on. It could be something with work already that you already have in a job and you're looking to maybe jump ship. Um, and you've already made up your mind. So there's really not too much procrastination during this week. You already know what it is that you want. But at the same time, you're using a lot of your emotions to get the best of you. To the point where you're um, like guarding yourself a lot and you're um, trying to bottle everything and trying to, to refocus. But at the same time, it's like you're already focused. You already know what it is that you want. There is no second guessing. You know, your mind is made up. You have um, you know and you're sure of what it is that you want to do. Just go for it. You know, um, this week is saying, you know with the the eight of wands in reverse yes it's going to come a little bit slow and communication is going to be a little bit difficult but at the same time you're the one that's able to tame everyone that's around you um with the the strength card the strength card is telling you you have not only the inner strength but you also have the emotional strength for you to get over any obstacle that you may be feeling this week you know as the king of pentacles shows up He's telling you, you know, be, be a business person, be that, that person that everyone could turn to and say, Hey, you know what? She could give me advice or he could give me advice. And they know exactly what it is that they, they're talking about because you have a good head on your shoulders, you know, um, followed by the high priestess and this high priestess, she's telling you, you have, you hold everything in your power. You know, you hold the book of knowledge, you know, you're the the balance between everything um, in your surrounding right now, emotionally, um, with work, with your household, with friendships, with relationships. You know, just take it one step at a time, but be sure and be confident on what it is that you're doing this week. You know, don't think about anything that's happened in the past. The past is the past. Leave it back there. You don't need to bring it back today because all it's going to do is going to keep you um, ground, um, you know, keep you anchored and it's, what's the point of being anchored? Then you, what you're going to do, you know, you can't move forward. So use, um, your abilities this week to, to hone in on, on that opportunity that you have for you to move forward, for you to, to change a job, for you to start a business, for you to start even with writing, um, maybe you want to start a blog. Maybe you want to start a new Instagram or a new Facebook, a Facebook group to talk about anything. It doesn't matter. Um, just to have conversation, do it. You know, it's really telling you it's all up to you. Emotionally and physically, you have the, the ability to do this. So go ahead and do it. Don't second guess yourself. So that was your reading for the week. For everyone, stay hydrated. I know it's a little bit hot today. It's going to be hot for the next couple of days. But if you did like this reading, don't forget to hit subscribe. Hit the little bell button so you can get notified for whenever I post up a new video. And also hit the like button. And if you want to schedule a reading with me, go to brujolife.com.